Hello mga ka-learning, this is Teacher Cha Ai. Welcome to Learning for All Seasons. In this video, I shall discuss part 2 on how to form the plurals of irregular nouns. Since in my previous video, I tackled regular nouns. These regular nouns do not change in spelling even when there is a change in number. They usually end in S or ES. If you didn't watch the video, you can check the link below. What is the meaning of irregular nouns? These nouns are those whose spelling changes when there is a change in their number or quantity. These are nouns that do not become plural by adding S or ES, as most nouns in the English language do. So let's have the following rules. Few nouns form their plural by making other changes in the word. Let's take a look at the following examples. Goose, geese. Woman, women. Tooth, teeth. Foot, feet. Man, men. Child, children. Ox, oxen. Mouse, mice. Person, people. Louse, lice. Another rule is, few nouns have the same form in both the singular and plural forms. Many of these are names of animals. Take a look at the following examples. Fish, fish. Sheep, sheep. Bison, bison. Moose, moose. Shrimp, shrimp. Spacecraft, spacecraft. Deer, deer. Trout, trout. Now let's have the foreign plural nouns used in English. Let's have the following rules. Nouns ending in SIS are spelled with SES in the plural form. Let's have the following examples. Analysis, analysis. Basis, basis. Crisis, crisis. Thesis, thesis. Nouns ending in US Change the ending to I or ERA to form the plural. Let's have the following examples. Syllabus, syllabi or syllabi. Cactus, cacti. Focus, foci. Alumnus, alumni. Genus, genera. Nouns ending in UM or ON change the ending to A to form the plural. So let's have the following examples. Terum, data or data. Forum, fora. Curriculum, curricula. Bacterium, bacteria. Erratum, errata. Nouns ending in X form their plural by changing X to C before adding ES. Let's have the following examples. Appendix, appendices, or appendixes. Matrix, matrices, or matrixes. Phalanx, phalanxes, or phalanges. Pontifex, pontifices. For foreign nouns of French origin, they form their plural by adding X to the word. Let's have the following examples. Tableau, tableau. Bow, bows. Batu, batu. Trousseau, trousseau. Always remember, irregular plural nouns are irregular nouns in the plural form. An irregular noun is a noun that becomes plural by changing its spelling in other ways than adding an S or ES to the end of the word. These rules for irregular plural nouns must simply be memorized, although it is helpful to understand the patterns first to master them. Thank you for watching. I am hoping that you learned something from this video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and click the bell for more updates. See you!